All right, today is the day. Today is the day that we go to Kanto. What the fuck? Oh, I forgot there was a pillow right here. I was like, what the fuck is that? All right, I'm, of course, the Tom the Bomb. Uh, this is episode 20... Fuck. Damn it. 26, 27... 28, I think? Damn, 28. We're almost at 30. Uh, I had a new team member. So we had to replace Ducky, and I realized that replacing a Dragonite is hard, but, uh... Well, Penelope's gonna have to do. Looking at the stats, uh, Donphan, aka Penelope, acts as a both defensive wall and a uh, physical attacker, so that's pretty much the reason... Oh, shit. Is my game volume too low? There we go. My bad. Yeah, but, um... Axe is both a physical wall and a physical attacker, so now my team has two special attackers. And then I have two mixed attackers with Flimblesner and Caesar. I have a wall on both sides, and now I have another physical wall and a physical attacker. So I, I think our team's pretty good. Also, it learned Ice Shard for some reason by level up, and I taught it Poison Jab to deal with grass types. And of course it has Earthquake, so great. Now we have a way to not be bothered at all. Um, so I did go down here, you know, obviously... And my mom told me that Professor Elm was looking for me, and then I immediately flew back to Victory Road and trained Penelope up. So let's go ahead and talk to Professor Elm real quick. Alright, sound is working. Great. Actually, let me make sure I'm on the right fucking thing. Yeah, okay. Alright, we, we should be good. We should be good. Sorry about that. Thomas, there you are. I called because I have something for you. See, it's an SS ticket. Now you can catch Pokemon in Kanto. Awesome. To Kanto we go. So our first gym is going to be a rock type gym, and I'm, I'm, I'm literally not worried. Uh, we have a nice updated badge case. I actually haven't even created that layout yet, so I don't even know what it looks like, but I'm sure it looks dope. All right, we, we, we got to get over to Cherry Grove so we can fly. Yay! Let me get my flying Pikachu real quick. God, I wish someone on my team like actually benefited from knowing fly. Wouldn't that be something? God, I just looked like a, a specter. Okay. Olivine City. I, w I didn't grind anything. I, I just got Penelope up to the same level that the rest of my team was. I don't know if I should have grinded them up before doing this, but I think we'll be fine. If we could beat, if we could beat the Elite Four only losing one Pokemon, I think we can get through a fucking cruise ship. I think we can get through a cruise ship. And, oh, one more thing. Part of me wants to uh, get rid of Ice Beam now on Gino and give him Thunderbolt. So, well, I don't know. I could get rid of something. I could get rid of Ice Beam on Porygon Z and just give him Shadow Ball. Because then I could deal with Ghost types a lot easier. We'll see. I'll leave it on for now. I don't necessarily need Ice Beam and Discharge because they, they kind of kind of cover the same things. It's time for your inventory to match who you are. Let me give you an item known from Legends. This is the Lock Capsule? The fuck? What's the Lock Capsule do? It's up to you to find out what the item actually does. If you happen to know any archaeologists, they can help. Oh, time flies. I have a radio show to record at Goldenrod. Uh... Lock Capsule? I have no idea what that does. Have you been to Kanto already? I hear many rare Pokemon live there. Sounds exciting. I hope so, because we get a shit ton of more encounters. Oh my goodness. Welcome to the fast ship SS Aqua. May I see your ticket? Dang, Skippy, son. Step aside, step aside. Let me on this ship. Man, look at this redundancy check here. Making sure that no one can get on if they get past the first guy. They have to get past the second guy, too. Lot, we have lots of that at my work. Ooh, this looks different. Has this always looked like this? I thought we came in from the top. Excuse me, I was in a hurry. My granddaughter's missing. She's just a wee girl. If you see her, please let me know. Okay. I guess we'll just start exploring rooms. Oh, here's this dude. This is what? I'm awake, of course. Oh, that's the dude that's slacking off, so we have to, we have to talk to someone to engage that dude. Here's your cabin. If your Pokemon are hurt, take a nap in the bed. Sweet. My cabin. There's a PC in here, too. Just in case we lose somebody. Okay. And this... Yep. Sweet. 
You know there's going to be tons of battles. That's a fire breather. Tons of battles. Uh, Typhlosion. Ooh, he's going to die. <laughs> uh, I know he has Thunder Punch, so I was a little scared. But then I remembered I'm choice spec, so I didn't care. Nothing in here. My immersion. Empty rooms. Oh, that's a double battle. I don't like that. Deli bird? Good lord. Uh, well, that thing's basically worthless, so I'm just going to kill it. And then I have a Dawn fan for Earthquake, but no one can really absorb it. I mean, Oogie could probably take an Earthquake pretty well. Eh, it's not really worth it. It's not really worth it. I'm going to put Fumble Snare. You know, I'm going to put my starter pair in front, because they're both level 58. And the, these these bitches always have, like, wiggly tufts and shit, so... A fighting type will be good. I really want to know if Flimblesner is going to learn a better move. I'm going to look that up, actually. Hold up. I'm, like, looking on OBS to see what they threw out. Blaziken, fourth gen moveset. Okay, let's see what he gets. He gets... Apparently he gets Sky Uppercut at level 59, so if I had waited just one more level... I would have learned that he gets Sky Uppercut. But that thing's a flying type. I mean, surely I'll outspeed this thing, right? And then that thing's a ghost flying. It might have, like, acrobatics or something. This might be a little fucking risky, leaving him in. But I'm going to go ahead and throw out Neo for Caesar. And I'm going to Brave Bird Tropius with Flimblesner. I just realized I'm about to take recoil damage and then get hit with a flying move, so... Let's hope that I don't die, because that would suck. That would suck indeed. Fucking volume, man. I can never get the volume right. I'm so sorry that I'm so bad at this. Why am I not speeding up? Oh, Shadow Ball? Man, we know that ain't gonna do shit. Now I'm gonna, now I'm gonna swap him into Oogie, just so I don't get unfaired somehow. Okay. I was kind of scared of Aftermath, which, uh, would hurt me after I kill it. Man, why am I healing when I can just go back to my room? That's a Hiker. I'm gonna put Caesar in front. Ooh, that's an Obama Snow. Uh, Ice. Ice is a problem. Am I- do I lose to Ice? I think my team actually... well... yeah. Pseudo Wudo, huh? God damn. Get fucked, kid. I'm still using hyper potions. I'm still doing it. What do you have to say? You butler? Most passengers are trainers, they're all itching to battle. What a cool cruise line. Oh, that's the granddad. Okay, so the granddad's in that cabin. Gotcha, gotcha. You there, do you know Fion? If you can show me a Fion, I'll give you a reward. Man, I know where to catch one, but I can't because it's a Nuzlocke. Oops. This boat looks a lot different than I remember it. I swear it used to come in from the top. Uh, he's sick. Urf. Oh shit, he wants to battle. Man, don't throw up on me. Ooh. I didn't even notice. He could have exited me into oblivion. Uh, Scyther, huh? Let's see, what's he gonna go for? Wing attack would hurt. If he goes for a wing attack, I can't go into Flimble Snare. I'm gonna go into Penelope. Well, hold on. I get Ice Shard. Jinx. I remember what happened last time I fought a Jinx. It knew Focus Blast. Man, Jinx actually destroys me actually fucking destroys me. I think Gino's the play. Oh, he has dry skin. What the fuck? He went for a ring out? Isn't that a grass move? Of course you paralyze me. Uh, I guess Aura Sphere is neutral. Oh, choice, choice, but, uh, fucking fuck. Uh, I'm gonna heal again to see what move it's gonna go for so I can kind of make an intelligent switch. No speed up. Ring out. Okay. Okay, that's a grass move. Or is that normal? 
put his ring out anyways. I don't even know what typing that move is. Ring out move. Someone just tell just tell me what the, it's a normal type. Okay, it's a normal type move. So it has ring out, it's gonna have a psychic, it's gonna have an ice move, and it has body slam. Therefore, it does not have focus blast, so I'm safe to go into Neo and Signal Beam. Mr. Mime. Uh I'm just gonna go into Oogie here and Dark Bulls. Alright. We are gonna go back to our cabin now and heal because we're intelligent people. We are in fact intelligent. Yay, we did it. Damn, we're already at ten minutes, what the fuck? Man, my computer's too good, I'm speeding up way too fast. Uh nothing over there. Okay, this is the guy. Could I get you to look for my buddy? He's taking it easy somewhere. That good for nothing. I'm on guard duty. I'm pretty sure the little girl's back there, too. Hariyama. Uh. Okay. I was scared of a belly drum. Golduck might have Ice Beam. He might have Ice Beam. So, I'm gonna discharge. Uh, do I need to heal? You know what, I can just Giga Drain. It's not a big deal. Let's see, was he in here? Yeah, he was. The boat's a lot smaller, too. I might be getting confused with SS Anne. You know, it's actually been... It, it... I think it's been, like, five or six years since I've gotten this far in 4th Gen uh, Gold and Silver. Man, I'm so excited. This is awesome. I'm so happy we beat the Elite Four. Machamp, huh? Okay. Well, uh, I clearly can't stay in because Fire Ice Punch would devastate me, but Gino could take both of those. However, my team doesn't do well against. I got Flimble Snur and I could Brave Bird him. Oh, he went for a cross chop? That's nuts. I was pretty I was pretty confident that was going to kill. <laughs> uh Kingdra, okay. That's a problem. I do not have anything that's super effective against Kingdra. So I'm going to toxic. He could go for a bunch of dragon dances though and fuck me. Oh, of course. Of course you miss though, like Yeah. Uses dragon dance and then it goes for Brian. Predicted by the way. That's a big brain moment. That is a big brain moment. Can you keep it a secret that I was taking that here? Please do not tell the captain. You know what? You're a piece of shit, so I'm going to tell on you after I heal. Alright. Now, let's go check out the engine room. Here's a picnicker just standing here. Oh, uh, horn drill! Uh! Okay. Man, that generator noise is annoying. Uh, I really hope y'all can hear me okay. It's the, the new mic is skeeving me out. I feel like I'm not calibrated to it yet. I'm very, I'm very, again, I'm very sorry if I'm, like, shouting at you. Just trying to get used to it. Like, I'm used to the thing being, like, here, and it's, like, way back here. So. What's up, dude? This little girl keeps asking me to play with her. Ouch, please don't stretch my ear. Captain, play with me, please. I'm bored. I want to play more. Wow, are you going to play with me? Let's play hide and seek. I'll hide, so close your eyes. Alright, let's go find this stupid bitch. Okay. Not up here. Uh, you're not near the engine. Not in here. Great. Not there. Oh, there you are. Oh, you found me. I better go back to my grandpa. I was playing hide and seek with this guy. I heard you entertain my granddaughter. I want to thank you for that. Please take this. I got a metal coat. I think I have two of those now. And that's what you get in the uh, original game, too. Man, we're already at fucking Vermilion? It's only been, uh... It's only been... 15 minutes. That was easy. Hold up. Let's look at the map. Look at this. Look at this. We're in fucking Kanto. Nice. 
Yeah, I don't know how it does it, but I know it railroads us over to Pewter City, and then we go through here, and we fight Surge. Let's see what happens if we try to go in Surge's gym. Man, this floor is dope. Look at that. What's up, bitch? You came from Johto? I envy you. Wow, that's what the other girl was saying. That's funny. They both think that they both find rares. There's an item right there that I need. Skilled trainers gather in Kanto. Gym leaders are especially strong. They won't be easy to defeat. I fucking bet, man. I definitely understand. There's Diglett Cave. That's probably how we get the pewter. Fucking fat-ass Snorlax. I would love a Snorlax. I already know what I want to name it. I'll name it Cornbread. I will name it Cornbread if I catch it. And I'll add that fucker to the team in a goddamn heartbeat. Uh, let's go ahead and buy some more Hyper Potions, because you never know when you got a heal spam, even though we die every time we do it. Uh, oh, I need Ultra Balls now. You know what? Let's just max out on Ultra Balls. We're about to get a lot of encounters. And let's explore the city. Saffron, Saffron, I want to go to Saffron. Magnet Train, Magnet Train. Yes, I know about the Magnet Train. There are eight gems in Kanto. The big building is Vermilion's Gem. Oh, the cut bush is gone. Thank God. Are you looking to challenge the Vermilion Gym? Sorry, but our gym leader is currently absent. Why not check out the gyms in Peter and Cerulean? Oh, that's a Vermilion City encounter. It's a fucking Wingle, man. I don't want that shit. I can't even... You know what? Battle music's different. It is bumping. Great. It soars on updrafts without flapping its wings. It makes a nest on sheer clefts at the sea's edge. Um, what the fuck was the name of that one in Emerald? Wasn't it Pico? I'm just going to name it Pico. I, I, I can't be bothered with this thing. I'm just going to give it a generic ass name. Okay, let's go get this item over here. Probably good, right? It's a luck incense. That's really not that good. Alright. Did I go in here? What's up, dude? Over many years, Diglett dug a large tunnel. The tunnel goes to a distant town. Great. Can't wait to catch me a Diglett. Pokemon fan club. What's up, dude? I'm the chairman. I've raised over 150. I'm very fussy. Do you visit just here? Sure. Rapidash. Cute, lovely, smart, irresistible, amazing. Oh, wild, beautiful, kind, hug it, warm, cuddly, spectacular, captivating, divine. Getting weird, bro. Getting weird. Thanks for hearing me out. I want to give you this present. He gives me a rare candy. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and use it. I'm going to use it right now. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to give it to Nia. No, he's about to level up. Fuck it. Penelope. Brand new to the team and already my highest level. He wants to learn Head Smash? Hell yes. 150. Okay, so I take terrible damage, but like... I ain't... I ain't no baby back bitch, first of all. I am I am not a baby back bitch. Okay. That's them. Pokemon Center. Let's go ahead and heal up. The fast ship is a great place to meet and battle trainers. Oh, you have some badges I've never seen before. You got them in Johto. A sleeping Pokemon is lying in the middle of the road. It's a fantastic opportunity to get it, but how do you wake it up? Oh, shit. Do I get the Super Rod? I'm the fishing dude. Have you met the fishing guru? He dreams about seeing the world's greatest Magikarp. Could you show him any Magikarp? Okay. No super rod for me. My Pokemon is preparing the land for construction. It's a Makuhita instead of a Machop. Hello, just when you least expect it, I'm Cameron. Fuck yeah, I want a picture taken. I should do like a picture montage of all the times Cameron has taken my photo. Man, our team is so fucking good. So fucking good. Okay. So I will get the encounter up here when I come... Should I do it now? You know what? Fuck it. I'll do it now. Route 6 encounter. Let's fucking go. That's a Kadabra. Ooh, I'm into that. I want that. That's really good. And it definitely doesn't know teleport anymore. So, uh... Okay. Well, I'm just gonna quick attack. Damn! I didn't expect to do that much. Fuck yeah. I already know what I'm gonna name it. 
If it uses its abilities, it emits special alpha waves that cause machines to malfunction. I don't know why, but I always name them Leopold. He might make it to the team one day. TM62 Silver win. That's a bug move. I'm headed out on a picnic. Do you know why? Or 20 minutes. It's not too bad. Far-fetched. That's, that's flying. That's a fighting flying type. Uh, not going to forget that. We're going to go into Gino and side beam into Oblivion. Nice. Now we have a Sceptile. Uh... I would just stay in an Ice Beam, but I can't. So I'll go into Neo and click Ice Beam. Ah! Nice. Okay. I'm going to clear this route out, and then we'll go to Diglett Cave, and then we will end the episode, probably. Uh... You know what? That team's fine. Are you going to beat us? We'll knock you flat. Oh, shit. We're gonna double team Minin. He just nasty plotted. What the fuck? Oh shit, choice band. I always forget, man. I'm not used to using items like this in casual, like, LPs. Man, you're setting up like a motherfucker. What the fuck? Oh god damn it. I have fucking Rock Smash since a fucking HM. 85? Uh. I definitely, definitely do not. That's so stupid, man. Why the fuck does that even exist? I guess I can't get it. I have heart scales. I'll come back for it. For fuck's sake. I will definitely come back for it. Uh, Slay King. He's definitely going to know a fighting move, so I can't go into you. I guess I'll just stay in. Oh! What?! WHY DO YOU HAVE COUNTER?! FUCKING WOW, MAN! WHAT?! That was just bullshit. He has been on the team for so long. Ever since Igniculus kicked the bucket, man. What a fucking joke. Counter? On Slaking. Counter? Slaking. What a fucking joke, man. What an absolute fucking joke. God, he, he did his fucking job, though. That's two rows, man. We have two rows of dead Pokemon now. Okay. Well, fuck. Now, now I have to figure out who my teammate's gonna be. Uh... You know what? I already know who my teammate's gonna be. It's gonna be Lucario. I think. Man, I'm very upset about that. I literally cannot do anything against that. Latifah's still there. I'm just gonna add... I'm gonna add, uh, Scrappy. That replaces the, uh, fighting, and... I think he's a... He's a... Neutral nature, so he should be a mixed attacker. Right? Yeah. Can't be flinched, but... Wow. That's so fucking stupid. Alright, let's go catch a stupid fucking Diglett. And be on our merry ass way. I got a doctor's appointment I have to go to as soon as I'm done here. Bunch of Diglett popped out. Alright, let's get a fucking Diglett. Uh If a diglet digs through a field, it leaves the soil perfectly tilled and ideal for planting crops. I know what I'm going to name it, but I got to look it up. Oh, God. That was Austin Powers? Okay. Remember that part in Austin Powers where that dude has the mole on his face and he can't stop saying mole? A-U-S-T-I-N. You know what? Austin's middle name is Danger, so I'm going to name him Danger. Austin 
danger powers. Okay, well, I'm fucking pissed, so I guess I'll go ahead and wrap up the episode. Next time, I guess we'll go through this fucking cave and beat the shit out of Brock to vent our frustrations. So I will see y'all next time. Yeah, I did nothing. Hydro pump. <laughs>